YouTube, Carlo here. Welcome to the vlog. This is the channel where we talk about sneakers, tech, and life. And for this episode, I'm excited to check out the newest store of Commonwealth. This is Commonwealth Power Plant Rockwell. If you haven't subscribed to the channel yet, please make sure that you do so because we're about to announce our giveaway. So I'll be dropping the giveaway mechanics very, very soon. So make sure that you guys are subscribed. Make sure that you hit that notification bell and make sure that you follow me on Instagram. Go! This is one of the most asked questions that I get on Instagram and YouTube. Carlo, where do I buy the Yeezy for retail? Carlo, where do I buy the newest Pharrell for retail? Carlo, where do I buy the 4D sneaker for retail? Carlo, where do I buy blank hype sneaker for retail? The, question, the answer to that question is very simple. You have to go to accredited official sneaker stores that drop those items, including Commonwealth, which is the store that we are checking out today, specifically their newest branch over at Rockwell Power Plant Mall. Let's do a quick background on the store. It's located at the ground floor new wing of Power Plant Mall. If you go inside, it actually has two floors. The ground floor has all of the menswear, well, men's sneakers, as well as the men's streetwear. If you go to the mezzanine, which is like a mini second floor, you have the sneakers that they have for women. And it also serves as a spot where they can do brand activations and pop-up stores. Something interesting, by the way, they were supposed to open several months ago, but they got delayed because they had to wait for their imported tiles. Yep, so you go there, it's like walking in a different country. So let's get to the sneakers. Now, if you go inside, you will automatically get distracted by a lot of the new drops, but the real gems are actually at the back of the store. This is just day one because they were selling Yeezys for retail. Yes, folks, they were they dropped Yeezys, they sold Yeezys at retail prices during their opening day. What did they have? They had the Yeezy 350 Boost Blue Tints. They had the Yeezy 350 Boost Butter. They had the Yeezy 350 Boost Zebra. So those are the 350 Boosts. They also had the Yeezy 500 Utility Black, as well as the Yeezy 500 Desert Blush. On top of that, they had the Power Face Calabasas in gray, and the Yeezy 700, 750 or 700? Yeah, but they had the, seven, the Wave Runner. Yeah, the Yeezy Wave Runner. All of those you could buy not for like hype crazy overpriced prices. They were selling them for retail. Hey, let's not stop there. They were also selling the recently dropped Acronym Prestos. This is the Acronym Presto with the vault colorway as well as the black and gray. Both of which were sitting there in broken sizes. If you weren't able to cop a pair when they dropped, it would have been a perfect time to do so when they opened their new branch. And of course, they also had the new, well, not new, they, well, the recently launched uh, Pharrell Williams Adidas Solar U uh, NMDs. Uh, this came in the three colorways or in the three models, the one that says Motherland, the one that says Power and Inspire, Power and Inspire, the other one that says like Forever or something. So those three sneakers were also available over at their new branch. Also had a lot of their previous sneaker consortium drops and collaborations. There was the undefeated Adidas Profeer. Uh, they had like the Etude or Etude or whatever it is, Ultra Boost. Uh, a bunch of the neighborhood Nikis and gazelles that they also had in the past. So all of those were available at the ground floor, all for retail. No patong, no crazy prices. You could actually cop them for what they were actually meant to be sold for here in the Philippines. Now, apart from those crazy Yeezys and, you know, Pharrells uh, and acronyms, they also had like a bunch of new drops for that special day. Of course, we have to lead with the Billionaire Boys Club Pharrell collaboration uh, with Adidas featuring their NMD as well as the Tennis U V2s. Now, obviously, I will be, actually, I was able to cop a pair, so watch out for my unboxing, official unboxing of the Billionaire Boys Club uh, Pharrell Adidas NMD that will come very, very soon. So watch out for that one, guys. Also had one of the most awaited sneakers, I think, uh, one of the most hyped sneakers of the year. I, of course, I'm talking about the Nike Element React 87. Now, this sneaker actually came out yesterday already over at Seoul Academy. So if you missed your chance because it was only in very limited quantities, who knows, it may be a very small chance that it might be still available over at the Commonwealth Store when this video gets uploaded over again at their brand, branch, branch in Rockwell. Also had the new Kendrick Lamar Nike Cortez. So this is the house shoes, lounge slippers type 
uh, slip-on of sneakers that you guys might want to check out. Shout out to the boys from Perea Boys. Uh, their Instagram account is so fire. You guys have to check them out. I think they were the ones that were tapped by Nike to be able to promote those pair of sneakers here in the Philippines. Cortez sneakers sell for just less than 5,000 pesos, making it one of the most affordable pairs that you guys can cop in that store that looks really, really dope. The Pharrell, by the way, Billionaire's Boy Club uh, NMD sells for 13,000 pesos. And React 87 sold for 8,095. Also dropped the newest sneaker consortium, Ultra Boost. This is the engineered garments uh, collaboration with Adidas for the Ultra Boost in that bright, well, dark blue color with streaks of red and yellow and white. Definitely a clean pair of sneakers with colors that just made it pop and come alive with so much character. And of course, you have that thick Boost Ultra Boost midsole that will keep you super comfortable if you wear them. They also had a bunch of sneakers from Asics. Now, the one that really caught my attention was the Asics gel mine they had it in two colorways one in black one in white looked super fresh in just a plain colorway with japanese characters along the side uh, i will be doing a review and unboxing of them that as well very very soon apart from all of those new sneakers and all those hype sneakers they also had a lot of the recent releases that you guys might be interested in uh, they had like a lot of the EQTs, a lot of the POD 3.1s. They had a lot of Air Maxes. They had a lot of Vapor Maxes. I mean, there's just a wealth of sneakers to be able to pick from if you guys decide to drop by. They also had like Van sneakers. Now, uh, the, I think what really makes it so special though, Commonwealth, is that they have a great selection of streetwear as well from international labels, including Made by Humans, which is actually a brand that was made by Nigo, the same guy who did Bape. So they have shirts of that available as well as socks over at Commonwealth in Rockwell Power Plant Mall. Going to the second floor, they had actually a pretty good selection of sneakers as well for the ladies. Now for the ladies, the one that really stood out to me was the Kylie Jenner Adidas Falcon. Now that was the one endorsed and worn by Kylie Jenner and sold out here in the Philippines. It, it's dominantly like a pink colorway with accents of blue, if I'm not mistaken, uh, of the Falcon. Sold out very fast. It's still available a few pairs over at their branch in Rockwell Power Plant Mall. That is the new store of Commonwealth over at Power Plant Mall in Rockwell. It's definitely a must visit if you are a sneakerhead, if you are a collector, if you are a streetwear enthusiast. It is a place that you guys just have to check out. If you're a guy who wants to buy like hype sneakers, like Yeezys and all the other upcoming releases, you guys have to be able to be in the loop for what Commonwealth has because that is one of your best chances to be able to cop those pairs without paying resale, without paying ridiculous amounts of money. And one thing that I love about Commonwealth is that the way for you to join the raffle is very painless. You don't have to line up ridiculous for like hours and hours, like 24, 48 hours before just to be able to cop a pair. They have an app called Cop Date, which allows you to just register electronically and you just get alerted if you win or not. If you win, come over and buy. If you lose, at least you didn't spend like a day or more than a day just to line up and the day ending in vain and in frustration because you didn't win. So that's the reason why I actually love joining raffles from Commonwealth because it is painless, it is effortless, and if you win, cool. So make sure you visit Commonwealth over at Power Plant Mall in Rockwell. It's definitely worth the trip. Uh, I'm probably thinking that when this video goes out, most of the hype stuff is gone. <laughs> most of the Billionaire Boys Club NMDs are probably sold out. Most of the Element React 87s will probably be sold out. Definitely all the Yeezys will be gone as well as the acronym Prestos. But hey, I'm pretty sure that they will keep on refreshing it with more hype items, with more cool sneakers in the weeks and months to come. So it's definitely worth, you know, just getting familiar, familiar with, making sure that you drop by and see what they have to offer right now. And if the sneakers aren't your, you know, aren't, aren't talking to you, the great thing about their store is that, that I have a fantastic selection of streetwear uh, and clothes like what I mentioned earlier. That's actually it for this vlog. I hope you guys enjoyed. Please make sure that you subscribe to the channel, follow me on Instagram, hit that notification bell, guys. It really means a lot. Helps the channel go a long way. Peace. God bless. number one toy sa Japan, which is bare bricks. Yeah. Ang ganda eh. Sarap. Lalagay mo lang sa sahig. Matibay. Hindi nasisira. So, ito. Paray Supreme mga nakolekta kong mga rare. Nandito na lahat ng Supreme stuff. Halos lahat.
yung nag-unboxing ako isang beses, ang dami niyang sinasabi. So, nasali sa Instagram yun. Nagagalit kasi talaga may katok siya eh. Sabi ko sa'yo eh, eto. Eto ang sapatos na pinakamahal sa akin, pinakasulit. So, sa lahat ng sapatos ko, siguro ito na yung pinakamahal na mahal. Music